again. In the previous uh, video, I showed you briefly some uh, some uh, set board settings. Uh, well, I think I only changed one of them, but there are many uh, many more settings you can uh, can change. So let's uh, look into some other options. First, we we go to a to a board, and then we click menu and settings. And here we see uh, we can choose uh, which side uh, we are bearing off, and as you'd expect, it switches. And we can change uh, the graphics on uh, on all the components. And the frame here, let me see. So that looks ugly. That's even worse. So you can choose, uh, you can go through them and see if you find something that you like. I think from blue is the default one here. And uh, let me see, a gray filter, yeah, that's a bit obscure thing. Uh, getting in some black and white uh, graphics or grayscale. And you can also choose uh, the graphics on the checkers. Uh, we can use this one. Which looks good there too. Yes, perhaps. Yeah. Good enough. Cube, we have already changed. Animate checkers, that's. Uh, let me see, I tried to put it on. And if you now click on a move, and no, that didn't work. Hmm, strange. Oh, there it Ah, that was. <laughs> That didn't look too good here. Uh, different browsers uh, handled it uh, this differently. So on Firefox, uh, this does not look too good. Uh, so you have to figure it manually. Uh, uh, it's uh, I'm not sure how how nice that is, but. Uh, so I'll turn it off. And also a uh, scorecard uh, on frame. It could be nice to uh, to more quickly uh, spot uh, what the current score is. Instead of looking at the top here, we can have it on the frame itself. Evaluation level. That's uh, perhaps a bit technical, but uh, let me see if we can try to turn it on. And then we see the evaluation level uh, that uh, in this case, there's XG who has uh, calculated this uh, evaluation and it says that uh, did it in, uh, in a four ply level. Details uh, expand. Uh, that uh, can be useful if you have uh, if you have a, a small uh, screen and when you click on the toggle details. This area will expand uh, expand a lot, and you can see uh, see all the de details here, and the board uh, is shrunk uh, accordingly. So, it could be useful uh, on some screens. And also, we uh, showed you earlier we can uh, resize it uh, in order to uh, to have, especially this area. Uh, have it visible when you are playing uh, against opponents, and this area will uh, will contain the the chat. That's uh, useful to uh, to see it. But normally you have it. Yeah, I guess you can size it up pretty big if you want. Yeah, see that uh, the checkers are getting a bit out of. Uh, Auto position here, and so uh, often when you have some problems like this, you can uh, reload the page. Let me see if it uh, helps. Yeah, and then it has uh, corrected it. Let me see what to set it. Clarity and set, and then. Uh, now we 
you should remember uh, that you have a larger larger bar let me see yes I know it uh, it remembered it I think that's all the interesting board settings yeah and the cube graphics I think that's it for for this feature. See you.